Okay, welcome back guys. We have a crazy challenge. We have to build a swimming pool for this neighbor here. We gotta cut down a couple trees here, dig the whole pool, hole out all the dirt, and properly place concrete here. Watch, we, none of us have experience with concrete, but we're gonna try, and we have way too much money. This series is not a part of the landscaping series. This is a whole different series. We're kind of starting up, and we already got some equipment, so we're good to go. We are gonna build this swimming pool. And I got my buddy Nate and my buddy Buck. They got a lot of experience, so they're gonna help us. He said he used to work at Chick-fil-A. Anybody who works at Chick-fil-A, I'm hiring him. He burnt my sandwich. So Buck's gonna get backed up. This is our equipment setup right here. This is our first truck we bought. It's a 0273 power stroke. It's got, a, it's got the engine cranked up a little bit, so hold on skid steers. It does amazing. We got two different Bobcats, a Bobcat 863, which has pretty high hours, high flow, so we can run nice attachments on it. And then we got another Bobcat 863. It's just a year newer than this one and has a little lower hours. And then two trailers, exact same size. And then we got a Peterbilt. This is our only dump truck. And then Buck actually just purchased this for the business. 2017 F350. What does it got? 50K miles, Buck? 30. 30K. Okay. No offense, boss man. Did you just say that was an O2? That's an O3, buddy. Okay. <laughs> Nate's over here. Knows his trucks like crazy. I should inform you guys, this is an 03. Now, Buck's new truck, we don't have a semi yet to haul this excavator. We're trying to talk the company financial person into buying a Eager Beaver dovetail to pull behind this thing, but that didn't work out. So, we talked Buck into hauling the excavator with his pickup truck. So, the excavator doesn't fit on there the best, so Buck's going to try and load this thing from the side. And this is really tough. It takes a professional guy to pull this off. And he's no professional. I'm just your local Walmart greeter. You got it, Buck. I got faith in you. There you go. You should have got closer before you did that, bud. Or you could reach. Oh, Buck, Buck, be Buck, careful. Buck, Buck, Buck. There you go. Okay, okay. Um. <laughs> Grab the other side. Grab the other side. Reach around. <laughs> Hang on a minute. We're gonna puncture a tire doing this way. Buck, if you turn your tire self around. Uh, yeah, there you got go. it. Good, good, Come good. On. Right there. Do we want to hold it like this? No. Okay, boys. Head out. Is the 6 7 keeping up? Oh, yeah. I got it in low range. We're just kind of got it. Just moving along. Okay. Watch the railroad. You're supposed to be the one watching out for power lines. No, no. I'm watching. I'm watching. Okay. Swinger wide. There you go. Okay. So Nate's got the. The road blocked off, and then I think he's blocking it off down here too, so nobody can go in and out. Did we ever talk to the cops about that, or we just st start throwing down signs? We're millionaires. Who cares? True. This uh, this is a private neighborhood, so we're fine. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh god. I'm getting there. I've done this before, once, maybe twice. There you go. Smooth as butter. Oh, no. Buck, we got a Karen asking about holding that excavator. Well, then Doesn't she think can it just was legal. file a complaint. Who cares what she thinks? Oh, gosh. All the weight's on one axle. <laughs> we should be good. And we'll back her off. So these Bobcats, these are going to be used to load all the dirt in the trucks along with that big excavator. But sometimes it's just handy having both Bobcats around to load the dirt. So for now, these are what we'll use. We'll use the mini excavator to dig. We'll back the other Bobcat off. Okay, boys, we need to take down a couple of these trees. Show me which trees we're taking down. This one right here. I marked it. There the we go. I'm sure we're marking them. Yeah. Throw an X right there. Okay, Buck, I'm going to start cutting her and then just toss her over with your excavator. I'll try. She's coming down. There we go. Okay, so we have the pool outlined and the trees cleared around it. So everything here, Buck went and grabbed his bucket and the big excavator bucket and kind of scraped everything away. So this is where we're going to be digging for the pool and then all of it's going to be loaded in that dump truck. Hang on, I think you need some makeup. Come here. Yep. Okay, so Buck is digging the pond here. He's dumping it into the dump truck. Dump truck's going to be full. Nate's dumping any excess stuff with the skid steer. And so we're going around with skid steers clean up all the excess stuff that kind of just gets piled off to the side. Sometimes when the dump truck guy is running dirt loads, we just have to pile the stuff from the excavator on the ground. And so it forms big piles that we got to load up into the dump truck once it gets back. So Buck's digging that. We're going good. This skid steer on tracks. I like wheels better for this type of stuff. Oh, and also we traded two skid steers because the other ones, they couldn't <laughs> lift the weight. <laughs> I forgot to tell you guys that. Would you like some dirt, sir? Yes, sir. Okay. 
Here it comes. Here comes the airplane. Merry Christmas. Okay, so we are pretty much full here. I'm gonna reroute around this guy's driveway and we're gonna go dump this quick at our like storage place. It's my wife's boyfriend's place. Okay, so we're gonna dump our filter back here and we're gonna keep this for more projects coming soon. Start dumping her. We'll probably have like two or three dump truck loads by the time this is done. There we go. Keep going. We got a lot of dirt here. Oh God, oh God, this is tough on the truck. There we go, we're empty. Good to go, we're heading back. Okay, Buck, where do I place this for the best loading experience possible? Well, I'm tracking to the other side of the hole, so you might as well just load it back over there if you guys are gonna be loading the truck. Okay, that'll work good, I'll try and back through there. We spilled a little dirt on the neighbor's driveway, we'll have to clean that up. We should be good though. Keep backing her up back here, we'll get her loaded. Right here, Buck? Or no, oh. Watch out, watch out, watch out! Yep, 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 we're good. We'll get her loaded in the truck. Nate, I'm behind you for one sec. Better be faster than that. Okay, I'm real slow, so never mind. There we go. Second load going in. Hey, Nate, it helps when you actually go over the top of the wall. It helps when you keep your mouth shut, too, but yeah, we, here we are. Gives me a Snickers bar. No, I need a Klondike bar. That or a Kit Kat. Hey, um, Grant, you know you're not supposed to be pushing the dirt back in though. I right? know, I know, I know. We're working right. on it. Chief Operator Buck, how much more are you thinking? That depends. How deep is the pool? Are we digging to China? Yeah, we're getting close. Okay, Buck, give me a push out of here. Because I'm not going to make it with this dirt underneath me. That's too bad. You keep <laughs> driving. <laughs> there we go. We should be good. We're good. Nate, you stuck? I got gotcha. you. Okay, so this should be like our last load. We got a hole out of here, and then we should be ready for concrete soon. And we'll pull in here, dump our dirt, back her up, and start her dumping. And we're empty. Perfect. Okay, so we pretty much got this whole thing done. And we're ready for the concrete. Oh gosh, don't smash that guy's car. Okay, we're good. We're gonna be ready for the concrete guys. So we're gonna kind of get all of our equipment out of here, let them come in, do their thing on the pool, and basically we just do cleanup work after them. We might have hit a water line. Ah, it's the it's the water table. We'll just I, I heard something go. I think when you're digging, we'll just call it the water table. We're good. We'll just call it. That's not how that works. Yeah, it's the water table. It's all good. Okay, so we are packing up and the pool is complete. Concrete guys did a nice job on it. And then we finished up cleaning all the landscape around it, cleaning up all the dirt. She looks good. And for some reason, Buck disappeared. He said he was going home to change his clothes. I think I got an idea what that's for. Get him out! Oh, God. <laughs> Aerobics! Buck, get out of the pool, man. No, man, Buck, I'm swimming in my pool. undies. I'm it's swimming in my undies. They're home, Buck. Get her out. Homeowner won't be that mad, will he? Hey, we just spent nah, five screw hours it. on this. We got a little time. Woo! It's a little warm over here in this corner. I'm getting out, I'm getting out, I'm getting out, I'm getting out. Pool is done and looking good. We got paid for all the dirt work and stuff we did. She's good to go. And now we're going to be on to the next job. And there's Buck. He's hauling back the excavator. He's going the wrong way, ain't he? Yeah, he's going the wrong way. And we're getting the last load up here. Nate's, this is how we do it. These axles are not ready for this much weight, but we have enough weight on the tongue of the dump trailer, dump truck where we're fine. Oh, wait, hold oh, on, on. We forgot the cones. We forgot the cones and the toss them in the back. Aw. There we go. Toss them in the dump truck. Get this stuff tossed in. I mean, we could just let the neighborhood kids have it, but okay. Okay, perfect. We're, oh wait, nope, never mind. We still got more <laughs> to toss in. We were being safe for the first time, yep, okay? Yep, yep. Get them all tossed in. <laughs> but there's a car trying to pass Buck right now. <laughs> there you go, he's making the turn in there. <laughs> and we're back, we're done. Anyways, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If so, drop a like down below. And hey, check out these guys' channels. Links down below. And we will see you in the next one. Thanks, guys. There's a train!